Got a camera there and a camera there. Whew. One's a 3D camera that uh, I originally wanted an iPhone 15 to make videos for the Oculus Quest headset and other VR headsets, but my wife said no. Then I did some, mm, mm, ah, Corona. But then I did some, um, then I did some research and found out the camera I had was better than what the iPhone could put out. So, since I'm home on, I don't go back to work till July 3rd. So I'm making videos, uh, tufting. This is Tuesday after Memorial Day 2024. Tomorrow, I'm gonna tackle the yard. Hit up Home Depot, make a frame for Prius pool. That way she'll be between wax in it. Don't you know. But that's the deal right now for what I got going on. Ah, what? Now, the um mm. Can you believe TikTok said I was promoting drug use by smoking a cigar? Whew. So anyway, what I want to talk about today. Some good shit. Mm. Some good shit you're talking. <clears throat> I'm going to give you a symptom. Your back hurt. Your stomach hurt. Kidneys are hurting. Your bones are hurting. Good morning. Oh morning. man, that's some good shit you're talking there, Irie. It's my neighbor. Anyway, your back hurting, your bones are hurting, your kidneys are hurting, you're depressed. Oh, you're dope sick. This you're irritable. You can't dope. sleep. It, yes. You know, um, you think you got food poisoning. And um, there's other ones. You think you're about to die. You're just sick to your stomach. You're vomiting. You know, those. All symptoms of dope sickness. Dope sickness is when you are a um, you're addicted to opioid. Snitch. You're addicted to opioid. Okay. That's my cigar. You're addicted to opioid. Hey Chico the God Dog. And um, Hello Chico. <clears throat> yeah, could be anything. Chico, could be dog. heroin, crack. Chico I don't know if crack's opioid or not. Hello, Chico. But um, you know. Hello, Chico. Heroin. Chico the God Dog. Perks. Um, all Kyrie, these Chico. prescription pills. Hello Chico. Come on. Come on Chico. Oxys Come that's on, made Chico. for pain. Come it has on, opioid Chico. in it. The opioid in the, in the Come oxys. On, that's why you see Chico. them there say 510 or 5110 whatever. That 5 is the opioid. Chico the opioid takes the pain away. Makes you sleepy, uh, so you can get some sleep. But, um, some people abuse those. When they abuse them a lot, they gotta have them oh, all the time. Good, they good. go through great lengths to get them. Usually somebody knows somebody who knows somebody can get them for you. No. Mm. When you have that, I'm, I'm, I was, I have never seen it firsthand, but I was told it wasn't a good sign. Now, back when I was working EMS years ago, late 90s, early 2000s, we ran across a guy in Trenton, New Jersey, who was passed out on the street. This was before the Narcan days. My partner, I was with named Andre, he forgot to put a mask on. That fucking dude vomited on him. He was pissed. I understand why he was pissed. Cause dude just threw up on him. You know? Now you won't be able to see it in the 3D video, but in the 2D video, mm -hmm. there's a dude in that chair right there. There's a dude in that chair. 
think that motherfucker's real. You're crazy. This is a figment of your imagination. Because I can't see nobody sitting there. And that's what's crazy. Anyway, because my 3D camera only has about a, I think a 15 minute battery life. I'm going to keep this short. Keep it short. Keep it short. Keep it sweet. Got it. Anyway. Dope sickness. Like I said, people feel like they're about to die. You know, they, and, and they try to get pain meds off you. They come up making an excuse, oh, my back hurt, or this and that. Now, people who have dope sickness, I've never heard of them using weed to cure that sickness. That's the body going through withdrawal because it took so much. Now, I got a buddy in, um, in the South who got some knee surgery. You know, his pain was so bad, his doctor told him to take two oxys. He couldn't tolerate him. He could not tolerate him. He said he was shaking and everything. His body was rejecting that shit. So I know that if anything ever happens to him, they say, oh, he was high, he OD'd. Nigga, I'm coming with that too, eh? My boy didn't OD. You're dancing. I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna let you, him ask you why you did what you did to him. That nothing, ever, nothing never happened like that. Cause that motherfucker more tweet than I am. I got a semi AR. He got a weather is sweet. Automatic AR. Mm -hmm. Got 30 Three rounds, weeks? 60 rounds. Two weeks. The difference between me and him is. What's the date? 27th. 30th has the September, April, June, November, August. The between me and my boy Moku is. I'm a tactician, a better gamer than he is. And um, one thing we do both agree on. Oh. The reason he has capacity in his magazines like that and his guns fully is because he's a police officer. One of the finest in the South. SWAT. Anyway, one thing me and him both agree on, <clears throat> him being up here in Jersey, him being way down there, is that Butter Rod's trying to stick. <laughs> and my boy Joe. Is his name Joe? I think it's Guido. I forget what his name is. It might be Joe. It's four more days this month. Might be Mato. No. It's four more days this month. Light skin nigga. That's his name. I don't know his real name. He's called Light Skin. <clears throat> There's nothing wrong with being gay in this year and time and age, but found out Joe likes. Crazy, huh? Wow. He was crazy than that. Dope sickness. Not only am I making this video about dope sickness, also let me test out my yeah. mm. my 360 camera. That is good. At the end of the day, actually, I'm glad you got sun over here. Now it's like a sunny spot. I'm probably motherfucking vegetables, y'all. Ah, it is what it is. <laughs> <laughs>